Once again, Hampden Park is the setting for the most important date in Scotland's soccer calendar, the Cup Final. Celtic in hoop jerseys kick off against Aberdeen. 134,000 ticket holders watch Goalie Martin deal with a Celtic attack. Aberdeen take over. Young Jim Clooney is substitute for the injured Joe O'Neill. Celtic hold firm and soon their right wing is on the move. Clooney, number 10, drops back to help out as danger threatens. Another forward, Hamilton, is there to help clear the Aberdeen line. Over to Clooney, who has a go. Bonner parries and Buckley shoots wide. That was nearly something to cheer the Dons fans, but now Celtic attack. Fallon eludes centre-half Young, but goalie Martin smothers the ball. There's plenty of thrills in the first half, but still no score at the halfway mark. Play resumes with Leggett taking a corner for Aberdeen. Still quite unruffled, the Celtic defence works the ball away and off they go again. Mocken centres the ball, but Young puts it into his own net. A gift goal for Celtic. Aberdeen open up now and fight back grimly. Hamilton passes to Buckley, who beats Bonner, and there's the equaliser. Both goals scored within a minute. Aberdeen hammered away for another. Their halfbacks, with Glenn, number six to the four, help in the attack. Celtic swing play round and manage to force a corner. Here's another chance. Left winger Mocken takes it and Martin has his work cut out to keep the net clear. Celtic's forwards get it again but they hang on just too long and the Dons, by solid incisive tackling, gain possession. Back they go towards the Celtic goal. Buckley races in, but his shot hits the side netting. About 30 minutes after half-time, Celtic go away on another raid. Fernie forces the ball through to Fallon, who left foots it into the net. 2-1 to Celtic is how it ends, and Jock Stein receives the Winners' Cup. Celtic, as well as topping the league, take the cup home for the 17th time in their history.